let's do a hypothetical situation here. You yeah. have a generational talent for a son, right? Yeah. Let's just, you know, he's, he's, he's a phenom and everyone knows this in seventh grade and you know, yeah. more than most people now with your behind the scenes access stuff that you, you know yeah. about that wasn't even in the film. How do you carve this, this out for your son moving forward? This is a great question, right? And especially, and again, I, I hate to keep hitting the same note, but like when we talk about the cultural conversation around where, where this world is, I, well, most of what I hear, tell me, I would love to know what you think. Most of what I hear is it's long overdue, get the bag. This game is a business, right? Like it's this sort of like blind celebrating of all the new financial, uh, you know, windfall, et cetera. Um, and I'm not here to say that that's not, uh, not, you know, worth pursuing inside of the right balance. What I will say is that all of those same people who I find and to be mostly virtue signaling, when you put that exact question that you just put to me, to them, their opinion and position changes instantly because philosophically people are in favor of this because it is long overdue. And the system has been built for 70 years on the back of exploiting these kids. Like our film lays that out <laughs> very explicitly. However, whether where we've landed right now is a healthy or good place is an entirely different conversation and the rubber hits the road when it's your kid. So I think that, you know, for me, what I would say is number one, first and foremost, do you love this game? And I can connect this to my own life, right? In the, in the f filmmaking world, especially having grown up in Los Angeles, everybody wants to be a filmmaker, right? Everyone's got an idea. Everyone wants to be a producer. Everyone, you know, it's like, oh, right. Um, I'm now going into my second decade of doing this and I see people fall away from it because what I see is that these people want to be seen as these things, but not actually do the work uh, and do the things necessary to take whatever's inside of them and put it up on the screen, right? So I talk about a, the difference between wanting to be seen as something versus genuinely natively wanting to be that and needing to be that. Um, so I think that for my own son, I would be laser focused on, do you love this game? And that's, that's, that's the question really, because everything that flows out after that is informed by his answer to that question.